The weather isn't even close to the biggest headache for people who drive on Electronics Parkway. It's one of the more popular questions into our Your Stories team. Why haven't the traffic lights on Electronics Parkway been synchronized? News Channel 9's Nicole Semavilla says it's supposed to be part of a multi-million dollar project there to make the commute smoother. But many viewers are complaining they're still hitting nearly every light. Just constant stopping and starting. Michelle Miner is certain the traffic lights on Electronics Parkway are not on the same circuit. On her way home each day, she becomes the breaker. You end up stopping at least at three of them, it seems. Synchronizing these lights between Hopkins and Old Liverpool roads was part of a recent construction project, but the switch hasn't been flipped. Why are we sitting here? Why is there a red light if there's no traffic coming the other way? So we're testing it out ourselves. The throughways on our left, this traffic light just turned green, and already the next traffic light just turned red. And it's not that far apart either, maybe 100 yards. So we have not been able to make it through two traffic lights at a time so far. It's so inefficient. So what's keeping the county from powering up the new poles? Well, they haven't come yet. The DOT commissioner tells me there's a national shortage of steel traffic signal poles and says, quote, we are working on a temporary workaround for winter that will actuate the signals on Electronics Parkway until the new steel poles and signal heads are delivered to the contractor for final installation. When they do construction on these projects, you know, they do a good job. So I just wish that they do improve the traffic signals, hopefully soon. And until the workaround is put in place, drivers will have to keep one foot near the brake. In Salina, Nicole Somavilla, News Channel 9. Now the county also says that workaround is weather dependent, so they're waiting for that break this winter so they can do the work. To see the whole statement from the commissioner, go to localsyr.com.